Decades after a tragedy, a community is still clinging to hope. Good evening. Thanks for joining us for the CBS 19 News at 10. I'm Brennan Gurley. Today marks 31 years since Kelly Wilson of Gilmer disappeared and her friends and family continue to wait for closure. Tonight they held a candlelight vigil in her honor. Our Jesus Martinez was at the vigil and brings us more on why her friends still hold hope. If Kelly were here today, she'd probably have children about my children's age. Um, they may be friends. They may have been in athletics together. <laughs> Uh, we just would have shared a lot of the great things that happened in a small town. Jennifer Dean can just picture what life could be if Kelly hadn't gone missing. Dean met Kelly when she moved to Gilmer. She was a friend to a lot of people. She was friendly. Um, she made you feel comfortable. She was beautiful. She was smart. She was brave. A vigil was held in her honor as those who knew her recounted the memories from when Kelly worked at the video store. The last time I entered this building, I was 11 years old, and handed her VHS movies. That was the last night that she clocked out here. Kelly was last seen 31 years ago to this state of what used to be this video store. She was closing around 8.30 that night to put money in the bank for the day shift when she just disappeared. I don't know if she did was able to do her routine, which is make a deposit at a bank that's just right around the corner, or she did and she came back and something happened. Grainy surveillance video from that bank shows someone did make the video store's deposit that night, but it's unclear whether or not it was Wilson. There is no Many showed up in support of Kelly at the vigil, holding candles up high for her, hoping her friends and family, like Michelle Davis, will have some answers soon. Trust in God's goodness and faithfulness and hope for our future. A hope in the future Dean still holds on to. I do hold hope. I do. Um, there's several things coming together all at once, and I don't think it's coincidence. I think it's divine. Everyone hoping for peace and closure. In Gilmer, Jesus Martinez, CBS 19. Jesus, thanks for that report. The case is still open and active. If you have any information on Wilson's disappearance, please contact the Gilmer Police Department or the DPS Missing Persons Clearinghouse. We'll have that information on our website, cbs19.tv.